Right, the Memphis Shelby County School Board is moving forward in buying land for building a new high school in Cordova. District leaders have their sights set on a 36 acre property just a stone's throw from the back entrance to Shelby Farms. You're seeing it on your screen now. The new state of the art high school would be built for thousands of students who would have gone to Germantown High School before the sale of that building to the city of Germantown. Our Stephen Pimpo found from price to feasibility, the property comes with lots of questions. This could be the site of the brand new Cordova High School. Drone 24 captured this aerial view of the property, which school board members say is one of their best options. There's pretty limited uh, plots or areas of land that would work um, that are large enough for a high school. So we were looking between 30 and 40 acres um, and and proximity to the area that we would need a high school. MSCS would pay just over $3.5 million for the 35 plus acres just north of Shelby Farms on Fisher Steel Road. They said this is actually below what they were asking um, for, for the land. Also thinking about appraised versus market value, those aren't always the same, uh, but for the amount of land that we're getting, that it is a fair price for the district. That averages out to about $100,000 per acre. Comparing that with other local real estate prices, land on North Germantown Road and Macon Road and Country Village Drive cost over $300,000 per acre. The property is currently only accessible via two narrow roads, and area businesses hope that a new school also means wider roads and more of them. Mariority could be widened very easily, you know, so uh, I think that, you know, no problem there, and this could be cut through to Mullen Station. Business owner George Merrill, who's been there for 20 years and owns a section of business condos, says he would welcome the school to the area, and he says it's ripe for development. It's cooking right now for uh, some small businesses, some you know, apartments. The next step for MSCS is a feasibility study of the property. Make sure that the infrastructure supports our families and students. In Memphis, I'm Stephen Pimpo. The school district hopes to start a feasibility study of the property next month, but it could take almost two years to complete.